Hog fans rejoice because we already have SEC play here in Fayetteville. We just always like to get the party started a little bit earlier than the rest of the nation. It's Nick Walters here at Razorback Stadium as Arkansas opens their conference slate against South Carolina. Now the Hogs season opening win over Cincinnati last week bumped up the team to number 16 overall in the nation. Today they would try to go 1-0 in conference and 2-0 in this early season. As they say, it just means more. And Arkansas tries to show that they mean business in the SEC with a win over Spencer Rattler and the Gamecocks. It's another packed house on the hill, and KJ Jefferson is ready to put on another show. In the first, KJ swings it out to Raheem Sanders, and there goes Rocket, picking up a chunk of yards, and the sophomore came in hungry. Shortly later, he eats again, breaking all sorts of tackles, rumbling his way into the red zone. And on the goal line, Houston, we have liftoff, Rocket blasting through the pile and coming out on the other side. Kendall Brown's offense strikes first. Barry Odom's unit follows it up with big hits and big plays. Alabama transfer Drew Sanders already making his presence felt. Hogs up 7-3 going into the second frame, and Sanders still has the hot hand. Rocket keeps the rock, rocking it outside. Count that as his second touchdown on the day. It extends Arkansas's lead to 11, and the 11 on defense is giving South Carolina fits. The pass rush gets to Rattler, and Sanders provides the rattle. Razorbacks back with it, and some other running backs get some totes. A.J. Green chews up some well-earned yards. Back on the goal line for more work in the trenches. Handoff goes to Rashad Dabinian, and the freshman gets his first career score as a hog. It's all Arkansas on the second, leading 21-3, but a South Carolina run cuts the deficit, and while K.J. would march the field with an off-balance pitch and catch, we did halftime with the Razorbacks ahead 21-9. In the third, the Hogs D stays stout. Sanders on the edge, swatting it out. Rattler gets it back, but he fumbles again. Defenders flying all around, leaving South Carolina with headaches. But the Gamecocks find a vulnerability. Rattler has his man for a long distance touchdown, and all of a sudden things are dicey with a five point game. Hogs offense stalling in the third, but Bumper Pool isn't giving up the lead. On the blitz, the senior captain trips up the Oklahoma transfer for a sack. And speaking of a former Sooner, the transfer Jaden Hazelwood has it on a shallow cross, wrestling off one rooster and falling forward over another. Hogs with a spark, and on the first play of the fourth, it's a KJ keeper. Good luck stopping that truck in short yardage. 28 to 16 Razorbacks. Jefferson tallies his first score and he's not done yet. And swing drive, Rattler sends a dump off, converging tacklers and bumper pull punches it out. Hudson Clark hops on it and it's right back with Arkansas. A few plays later, number one fakes the run, creating time and chunking it. Warren Thompson with all sorts of separation, going up, absorbing contact and he hangs on. The snag gives some breathing room, 35 to 16 advantage, Hawks. Gamecocks trying to get back in this game, throwing it up for grabs, and Nudie McGlother makes a play. The LSU transfer going airborne to make it two straight games with a pick. Late in the fourth quarter, Poole would take an onside kick almost all the way back, and an A.J. Green touchdown on the ground would put this one out of reach. After a garbage time score by South Carolina, the pressure has Rattler get called for grounding, and it's a safety, and this one would go in the books. Razorbacks knock off the Gamecocks 44-30, Sam Pittman's a happy man, and so are his Hogs, as they win an SEC opener for the second straight year, and Arkansas beat South Carolina for the first time since 2011. Winning SEC games, SEC games has everything to, with rankings, bowl uh, possibilities, playoff possibilities, everything. I think it's a big deal anytime we win an SEC game, uh, no matter who the team is and all that, and it feels really good to be 1-0 in the SEC. So it's the Razorbacks toppling South Carolina 44-30 to start SEC play perfect and beating the Gamecocks for the first time in over a decade. Next week, these Hogs have Missouri State, and we'll have much more recap on this one tomorrow night on Final Score. Madison, we'll send it back to you.